Okay, so a lot of formulas. This is our centripetal acceleration with velocity. Okay, here's our centripetal acceleration with period. Okay, so it just depends on what they give you. These are centripetal force, and all I've done is I've just said F equals MA. But some people like to have a separate formula. So write these down if you want a separate formula for centripetal force. There it is, right? Okay. This is centripetal force. Obviously, you have to have the mass to figure out the force because F equals MA, right? And then here's centripetal force with the, um, with the period. Here's centripetal force with the velocity. Okay. Write these down. You might want to pause it here because you probably haven't written those down. Um, I'm going to go do another an example of this. It's really not very hard. Uh, but anyway, here it is. Okay, so a 5 kilogram object, uh, 6 meters per second, 75 centimeter radius circle. So I, since it's velocity, I have to use the one F equals mv squared over r, right? Okay, so that's going to be uh, 5.0 kilograms. Uh, v is uh, 6.0 meters per second, right? you got to square that, mv squared, right? And then the radius is 0.75 meters don't forget you know centimeters right you got to go 0.75 meters right okay so five times six squared divided by 0.75 and you get 240 newtons yay